All right, guys, well, I just couldn't let it go. So somebody else is actually covering the shop for me for a few minutes so that I can finish showing you around some of the things that we got going on because I want to make sure that you really know uh, what we're doing around here. It's a lot. So it's not going to be everything, but here you can see some of our baskets. Now, we do have the standard geranium and baskets as well as the ivy geraniums. We have more of those um, further down the here. We've got your papyruses here. We've got your herbs, all of your flowering annuals. All of those guys we have a selection of up here. We do have more further down though, of course. Now, I'm not going to go through every house because that does take me a while. And let's be real, you all get bored with it. So we're going to go take a look at a couple of highlights though. I want to go in here just because I know I've got my veggie lovers out. If you're thinking about your garden, if you're itching to plant them. Well, I do have the things, some things seeded. I've got the first two rounds already seeded for you for the ones that we do, uh, the heirlooms that we do from seed. So those will be ready here for weeks to go home with you or you know we have people buy them just like they are because they're already seeded and you can get them set uh this you can see is our new succulent area go back here just so you can get a better look at it here you can see we've got our a selection of our succulent mixes and hanging baskets gotta love those as well as uh quite a few of our four inch succulents now again this is not all of them there are more down in number seven um, this isn't even all of our seeded things. I've got in the seed chamber back there, I've got some purple peas, this magnolia sweet, uh, magnolia snap peas, as well as um, a couple lettuce. And what was the other thing that was back there? Uh, I've got a daddle pepper and basil. Oh, chamomile. And chamomile. I've got chamomile back there that I don't even see as well. Now, it is not the German chamomile that you most commonly see. This is actually a Polish uh, chamomile, I believe. So that's uh, going to be an interesting experiment to see what kind of a difference that makes. Here you can see our shrub bed, more perennials as well as a few of the shrubs there. We do have blueberry bushes. We have two different varieties this year. We have uh, Duke and Blue Jay. I'm pretty sure I mislabeled the signs and they say Jaybird, but it's Blue Jay. Okay, here you can see we have quite a few ice plants around. They are very popular for flowering ground cover. Uh, very low maintenance, nice spreaders, and you can see they are blooming already. They will continue to bloom off and on all summer. And here is really what I wanted to show you. This was the, so some of the biggest news of the week is that the first round of tropicals have come in. And yes, we've already had some of them going out. So we've got your diplodenia, your hibiscus. Whew. Uh, what else do we have in here? We have, this is a new one this year. I think it's actually, the variety is, there we go. So this is a bush daisy, one I'm overly familiar with, obviously. We've got your palms, uh, your ruelia, your monstera, your ferns, all of these big guys, the hibiscus trees, giant fig trees. I say giant, they're fiddle leaf fig trees. They're just quite large. We've even got some of the big bananas here in the back uh, that you can see here. And we have not these, but we do also have um, perennial bananas that will come back in our zone. But these you can see are the extra tall ones. So they start out nice and big for you. Oh, and those are citrus trees, I believe. We must have planted those here. So those didn't come in on the truck. All right. So that's really what I wanted to get a chance to show you guys, that we do have veggies, uh, we do have things ready for you, we do have things seeded, we have quite a few annuals and herbs, uh, we got tons of perennials, they're just everywhere. We actually ran out of room, so they're, they really are a little bit everywhere. If you can't find the one that you're looking for, let us know. And of course, I wanted to show you that we have those tropicals that have come in. I'm pretty sure that the cat is lost in the tropicals. I should probably find him. So I'm gonna go do that. Uh, but you guys should get in uh, while you can and uh, get ready so you can get out and get planting.